Pauline Bouvier was first diagnosed with MS nearly 20 years ago. Although she's resilient, she describes living with the disease as a nightmare. MS is a real bad situation because you're looking, there's so many things outside, but you can't get to them all. Her daughter Alexa Porter comes to the care home almost every day. It's been tough for her to watch her mom's condition get worse. That was one of mom's first symptoms when she was diagnosed, was a lot of numbness all down one side and not really sure where that came from. And then um, after that, she had some, um, a lot of balance issues and issues with vision. Um, fatigue was immense, fatigue. There is no cure for MS, but there is a controversial treatment called liberation therapy that advocates and some patients swear by. However, it's a treatment that's not currently available in Canada. Despite a growing voice of endorsements for the treatment, it's not without its detractors. And the MS Society of Canada doesn't advocate patients get the treatment or abstain from it. Like many Canadians, Bouvier is planning to go abroad, likely Costa Rica, to get the procedure done. And her daughter is fundraising through bake sales to pay for the trip and procedure. I've been doing um, home business trade shows where they've, they've very kindly let me set up a, a bake table and have it all as a fundraiser. And sometimes they don't even charge me for my table, which is nice. And although the Canadian government recently recommended further testing, the actual treatment won't be available for several years at the earliest. Too late for Bouvier. Robert Buffum, Chat News.